All praises to Yahweh, by some Yahweh Shai, by some Rakakwa Dash. Oh, they're shooting skyrockets. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, y
I mean, but right now he's at Shirley Impression. But what's they swimming about? Oh, uh, and that's true though, cause you, we out here. Oh, he's having there yelling now. Right, he looks dirty as hell, like he ain't got no money, broke as hell, but he's happy. How you gonna be living out here fucked up, broke as hell, but you was talking about you happy? You gotta lie to yourself. You know, you lie to yourself, you see what you're saying. Man, you don't go out the whole castle. Oh, you boy, you know he ain't running no free race. You know, he won't be catching Cody, bro. Some foreign shit. This says, better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof, and the patience and spirit is better than the promise. Be not hasty. Be not hasty. Oh. And we out in the rain. Hey, it could be worse though, cause last week was freezing, snowing, ice. Here we go. Be not hasty in thy spirit to be angry, for anger resteth in the bosom of fools. So do with a goddamn fool, you know? Oh, how that happy old spirit. Right, even Esau ain't too got no reason to be really smiling right now. Even Esau comes trying to catch hell, man. Yeah, you know he's going down. <laughs> he on his way out. Motherfucking devil on his fucking way out, man. Why you see all these fucking shooting? My Edomites. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The devil's starting to reveal himself. He's he's being uncloaked. Um, uh, it says. That's it, man. Surah 21 and 20, the fool lift up his voice with laughter, the wise man does scarce smile a little. Yeah, if you wise, what the hell you gotta be happy about? Hey, shit to be happy about out here, man. The only thing to be happy about is we got the truth. That's hey, it. Damn right. And we on our way up out of here, you know? That's the only thing yeah. you can be happy for is the future. Damn right. Shit, when you read the news, when you see all these missile defense systems going up, you see all these uh, uh, motherfucking nations shooting off their ICBMs to make sure the motherfuckers work. That shit makes you make you happy, man. That does make me happy. You know? And you see your boy Nat 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 yeah. You know, it's looking more and more likely he's like, oh, Why? Make that Trump just put them sanctions on our rent. Yeah. <laughs> That's some funny shit, man. If he went against that treaty Obama made with him. Right. You see the Israeli, Israeli the defense minister, he, he, he resigned. And now Netanyahu, he filled in for that position to the As the defense minister also. That's crazy, man. That's good, though. So I hopefully somebody be popping off, man. <laughs> that Yahoo means business too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he a hardliner. Yeah. And you know all the military experts are saying, and I was watching this on fucking C-SPAN. They're saying that Israel ain't prepared for no war. Yeah. They ain't prepared for no war. You know, just cause motherfuckers got advanced art, advanced weaponry and shit, that don't mean nothing. All they doing is just using this. Yeah, they just got technology. Right, but that, the, the major military experts are saying that Israel's not ready for no war, man. You know, but they, that's their problem. That's After their problem. military women too. Fucking Israel. The Israel. They're a bunch of weaklings. Fucking hell yeah. Hezbollah kicking their ass. <laughs> really? I mean, them Israelis, they're some weaklings. They're so, Amalekai, they're weaklings. They're a bunch of weaklings. Hey, you see your boy, uh, you see Farrakhan? He was over there, Iran. What he's over there talking about? It's clowning. When they say death to America with them, right, right. they made a big deal out of it. Oh, they got more people in the comments talking about fair and truth, and we lie on them. But they won't answer your question on what lines are we coming up with, you know? They won't answer the fucking question, they just ignore you. Look at this, you know Jake Dome, man. Jake is just the, dumb Yeah, because Farrakhan did teach the. The, uh, Jake was uh, in America and the Edomites. I know he actually said that. It's on video. It's on video. Shit. And people try to say he teaches that Jake is the chosen people. He don't even say that. But he's slick. He's sneaky about how he teaches. He, he says it in a way where he knows people ain't going to understand what he's saying. And fucking who, who is this teacher? Uh, Elijah Muhammad? 
You ever listen to him speak, right? He, he sounds like a he weirdo. Sounds, he, sounds, he sounds retarded. Yeah, you're like a retard. Dude, he him and the, uh, uh, what's the other one? The uh, Noble Drew Ali? Yeah. He sounds like he's fucking retarded. Did you gotta be a retard to be a Muslim? Probably just be in Islam? You often, you, something's wrong with your brain. You know that's some heathen shit. That's, that's a, that's, that's, that took the Bible and just mangled it. You know what I mean? It's twisted that shit all up. They really mangled the hell out of this shit. Yeah, none of them follow after it. They sure don't. You know, they should be known for having smooth ass faces, man. Oh, they sure do, don't they? Smooth ass faces. When they came up with the law, the, the Muslims, they say you're not allowed to drink. Who the hell want to be a part of that? Hey, you, ain't, you lost me right there, bro. You talking about you can't drink? You, I'm done. Get away. Hey, you even got Pastor Stephen Anderson. He tried to say you're not allowed to drink. Oh, Pastor Stephen Anderson. But he celebrate Christmas, but he says you're not allowed to drink. Okay. And so but he'll say it's a sin to drink. Right. That's that's fucking retarded. Because the Lord's Supper, they was sipping wine. That don't even make no sense at all. The Lord said the wine is his blood. But you can't drink. But the wine is his blood. Isaiah 56 and 10 says, His watchmen are gone. Uh, they are all ignorant. They all ignorant. Like all the uh, pastors, preachers, from all, the, all these religions, Muslims, Christians, Catholics, they all blind. They don't know. They don't know what the hell they're talking about. They just walking around in darkness. You know, say they they stumbling, fumbling. They can't break no scriptures down. They got no truth. Yeah, they stumbling, bumbling, fumbling. It says they are all dumb dogs. Dumb dogs. Now, you know, pastor up in these churches in America. They're retards. Hey, we're talking about the recalling people's names, man. What the fuck are you talking about? Dumb dog, that's a right. dumb bitch. What the fuck is that? Right. That's like saying calling someone a dumb bitch. Dumb bitch? Because we don't call people dogs in the English language no more. We call them bitches. They are all dumb dogs. They cannot bark, sleep, lying down, loving to slumber. Yet they are greedy dogs which can never have enough. And they are shepherds that cannot understand they all look to their own way, everyone for his own gain from his point. Yeah, so they most of these pastors and stuff out here, they just in it for their own gain. For financial gain, for their own fame. Like you got all these mega church preachers. They just in it to be a superstar and they get paid. Well, along with them Israelite groups? All them Israelite groups too, yeah. Nathaniel, Nancy Nate. He, he's in it for himself. He wants to be the superstar. He take the glory away from Yahweh Shai and try to give it to himself. That's why he don't call on the name of Yahweh Shai. He calls on Christ. And he say, he says, uh, you wicked if you say Yahweh Shai. Did y'all see any videos on that March though? All I saw was the, the article, the picture. No, I saw, I see. I just seen the elders video he put up. Right, I'm talking about, you know, here for Oh yeah, I didn't see it. That's what I ain't seen that I should have looked it up. Well, so it's probably didn't report it. They probably did. You know, but you think they would because they want to get that fame. Right. I mean, that, now they're working on editing the video. It's going to be super high quality. That's probably what it is. They're going to give it a... They're going to get a million views on it. Well, you know how they... they oh, yeah. How you might see get a lot of views. They're right, they do. Uh, thousands of them. Yeah. Thousands. And they got that high production. They can spend all this money on the production. You know? Hiring editors. Fucking marching like they pro like they out there like a regular protest. All the answers are right here in the scriptures. You motherfucker. Ain't nobody get edified from that. Where in the scriptures it say that the uh, apostles went marching? No, bitch, you just you just look. The apostles wouldn't move, they went to the war now. Why was your dick? Shit. They saw the prophets coming, it was like, oh shit. Yeah, they did. Oh shit. What we do this time? Didn't do nothing right. Like it says, come ye say they, I will fetch wine, and we will fill ourselves with strong drink. And tomorrow shall be as this day and much more. 
Or is that where is it? Where's the same one? I think so. Promise of each other. Success. Oh, like that. You know that has to be part of that IUIC. All the mother hits the right to kill. Their their Everybody get a cut. Right, right. Oh, they're higher up. Right. You, you're going to get your own scoop, probably. I can imagine the talk, man. Madness. The spirit here not going to be covered in infantry. infantry. And they probably promise the women, too. Like, I'm going to this bitch and that bitch. Yo, this one, this one uh, new bitch, her husband, he don't believe, so you can have her. Look like a stop, right? Lord bless it. Stop raining, though. Titus. Oh, let me get this right quick. And let's go right in what you talk about. Titus, uh, one and ten. For there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, especially day of the circumcision. That day of the circumcision is people that know they're Israelites. Okay? Because you got, like you said, there's a lot of Israelite groups out here. A lot of them, they making a lot of money. They making moves. They, you know, they trying to gain some fame. Oh, like IUIC, making all that money. But day of the circumcision, that means they know they, they're Israelites. They see that silver. Yup. Yep. What's that? The uh, 30 pieces of silver? 30 pieces of shame? It's like, you listen to that song? That, that Hate Williams song? 30 pieces of silver, 30 pieces of shame? Uh, it said, whose mouths must be stopped, who subvert whole houses, teaching things which they ought not for filthy lucre's sake. All you don't need to learn to be Yeah, just for that money. <laughs> The people get divided over that. that you no. Know, they say you can call the Lord by any name you want. When the scripture says the Lord's name is one. What's that scripture? Is that Isaiah or something? The Lord's name is one. This one is Zephaniah. That goes into the language, bro. This one is Zephaniah? Oh, uh, I'm trying to think that one scripture says uh, Yahweh's name is one. I'm gonna look it up. It might be songs. These are songs right there. There's a couple of them though, actually. They say you, because the Lord only got one name. They don't call him the name of the Most High. No, they probably believe in the Trinity. They probably say the Son is the Father. Do they say that? Yeah, that's madness. That's what all the churches teach. Actually, all the churches teach that uh, there's this thing called the Trinity and that the one they call Jesus is actually God himself. And that's not in the Bible. That is nowhere in the Bible. Not once. What's that? Uh, I got this one. I used to bring this out of love. Uh, it is one of them. Oh yeah, that's Zachariah. I, but that's not the one I was looking for. I'll read it though. Zechariah 14 and 9. And Yahweh, because it says Lord in all capital letters. See, when you read an English Bible, and you see that word Lord in all capital letters, when you look it up in Hebrew, the Hebrew name of the Most High is written, and his name is Yahweh. So every time I see Lord, I'm going to say the Most High's real name. And the Lord shall be king over all the earth. And in that day, Shall there be one Yahweh in his name one? In the English it says there shall be one Lord in his name one. So the Lord only got one name. He ain't got a whole lot of names. Like we talking about Islam. Don't Islam say God got like 80 names or something crazy? 99, yeah, something bullshit. That's a confused motherfucker. You don't know what the fuck you're going to do. Psalm 18 says that men may know that thou whose name alone is Yahweh art the most high over all the earth. Yeah, that's the one I wanted. Actually, I just pulled up. Yeah, that's that Psalm 83. Yeah, I gotta remember. I used to have that memorized. Read that again. That's a good one. Psalm 
so it was 83 and 18. Uh, that's what I said to you. It said, let them be confounded and be troubled forever. Yea, let them be put to shame and perish, that men may know that thou, whose name alone is Yahweh, art the Most High over all the earth. Yeah, so the name, the Most High's name was Yahweh. And he only got one name. His name ain't God. It's, okay. It's not the, the son of the Most High. His name's not Jesus. Okay. The Most High's name is Yahweh. And the son of the Most High, his name is Yahweh Shad. And they're not the same. The son is not the father. That's not in the Bible. Yeah. Uh oh, they go to the most spirits from the ancient world. You start bringing them heavy scriptures out, bro. The spirit, the portal of it. From the kingdom. That's a deep. That's even, that's even jump right up on it. So I took it to LeBron. That bitch, that sound like a deep. Uh, yeah, because how you supposed to pray though if you don't know the name of the Most High? Don't don't he say uh, the the pray to the Father in the name of the Son? It tells you that in the scripture. How you supposed to say the Lord's Prayer if you don't know the Father's name? But they say the name name is his name. The name his name is God. <laughs> How's it? Yeah, the Bible in Hebrew, so how you almost say God's name is God? Like, they'll say, oh, when you say God damn, they say you're taking the Lord's name in vain. That don't make no sense. That's fucking retarded. The scripture says they are all dumb and dumb. They are all ignorant. Because that word says vain, vain means vanity, means worth it, right? Exactly. So what? people in the world, they really take the Lord's name in vain because they say it don't matter what's called. Or whatever. So you yeah. just call the Lord's name perfect. Oh yeah, you're right. You say his name has no value and it don't matter. He said it. They really saying the name don't matter. It means the most high don't matter. That's right for what? Uh, uh, that's one that's taking matter. Here we go. That's a relevant thing. I got yeah. some. Yeah. That's not the Twenty-seven. When? Twenty-six. Oh then, when the captain, the officers were, you know, without funds, for they feared the people lest they should have been stolen. And when they had brought them, they set them before the council and the high priest asked them, uh, saying, "Did not we straightly command you that ye should not teach in this name? And behold, you have filled the room with your God, and the king will bring this man's blood." I bet it sound like look like mummer off the top of that. That's a demon, man. You know, ain't no shame, you know, shameless. It's a shameless dog. You can't understand what she's even saying. She don't understand what Probably wake up later, like, where was I? Right, right. What the fuck? Where was you at? Would you imagine me? Where are you still going into the name? The name. But this is just them, these niggas. You know, they're totally against the name anyway. Like, let me look at it. I'm going to start up a little higher. This is Acts 5 and 23, saying them 24. Now, when the high priest and the captain of the temple and the chief priest heard these things, they doubted of them words that they would grow. Then came one and told them, saying, Behold, the men whom ye put in prison are standing in the temple and teaching the people. Then when with the captain with the officers and brought them without violence, but they appeared to them, lest they should not fear that they had been stoned. And when they had brought, they brought them, they set them before the council 
and the high priest asked them, saying, Did not we straightly command you that ye should not teach in this name? And the thing is, amongst the mother is like groups, it might be one or two sincere brothers that you know that's, that's really doing this truth out of sincerity, man. They really want to seek the truth, but they're probably under, they're probably, they're under orders, man. There has to be one reason why they're pushing Christ and not pushing the name, man. You know? I bugged out, you know. Right. So something's going on behind doors that's there, they're totally against the name. Why else would this even be in the scriptures if it's not going to happen? Is that also so they got an agenda? That maybe they just ain't got faith in the Lord too, you know? That's the devil. Because um, you know, some people we tell them, tell them the Lord, uh, the son's name is Yahweh Shai, and they think that's ridiculous. They don't believe it. But when you go into the Hebrew, it's clear. It's clear. It can't be anything but Yahweh Shai if you know the Hebrew. Right, right. First time I heard it, man, I was like, something just rang in my head. Yeah, I was like, it I was like, I was watching the video. I played it back again and again. I was like, what did he say? Like, like Yahweh Shai. Right, 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 right. right. It got a ring to it, don't it? <laughs> it ain't power. Because people feel more comfortable with saying Yahshua or uh, Jesus or Christ. But that ain't none of them that the Lord's name. Yahweh ain't evil. Oh, Yahweh. Close, but close ain't close. Close don't get it. <laughs> I got a dictionary at home that says Yahweh was the reconstructed name of the ancient Hebrew. It, it, it says something like it was the modern pronunciation, but it pretty much saying that it's not the real way to say it. <laughs> it's some shit they made up in the 1940s. Right, 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 right. Yeah. It says, saying, did we not straightly command you that you should not teach in this name? And behold, he has built Jerusalem with their doctrine and intend to bring this man's blood upon us. And that's another thing, too, with this, with this devil that's ruling the earth. He, he tried to stomp the name out, but he couldn't do it because a remnant still had the name. The reason we know the name of the Most High and the Son is because the Most High kept that remnant over the years. Over the thousands of years, he kept that remnant that knew the name. They has to know the name in order for the Jews to teach whatever that bullshit they teach. The fact they that, don't say Because they know it. Right. Because we know keep it. asking them. Right. They know, like when we used to have that one devil out there to try to start to shoot us. We can't, he would not say the name. He was terrified. But he knew the name was Yahweh. The other Jews too. They know his name. Yeah. They do know his name. That's why they don't say it. They don't want nobody to know the name of the Lord. Right. They'll just say Hashem. Hashem this, Hashem that. Or they might might say Adonai or something. Hey, hey that's, a script, that's a spirit though, you know? The name of the Lord. Let's get that script. The strong tower. Proverbs. Well, I got all kind of scriptures for that one. We go all day with this one. It really is. It's talking about it. I'm gonna get that one real quick. Uh, Proverbs 18 and 10. The name of the Lord, which really in Hebrew says the name of Yahweh, is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. So the righteous run into the name and they safe. So I guess what? If you unrighteous, you don't have the name and you're not safe. Right? I tell you, IUIC, they ain't got the truth. If y'all there on YouTube, y'all follow IUIC. You better get up out of there. The Lord's going to destroy you. Plain and simple, because you're not safe. You're not calling on the name of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai. The scriptures clearly say that the name of the Lord is very important. So if you're not calling on that name, you're not safe. You're going to be destroyed. But the Lord, not the Lord, if you don't call on the name of the Lord, He don't hear your prayers. Especially, I mean, It'd be one thing if you didn't know the name, but once you heard us, heard us tell you his name, because the Most High's name is Yahweh, and the Son of the Most High's name is Yahweh Shai. That's what the name you're supposed supposed to be praying in. Not sweet Jesus, not Christ. Christ is a Greek word. Okay, Jesus is like an English form of the Greek name. It's not in the Bible. Because you gotta know the Lord's a. Uh, the one y'all called Jesus, he is a Hebrew Israelite that spoke Hebrew. And he had a Hebrew name. 
And there ain't no J's in Hebrew. So his name's not Jesus. In Hebrew, it's Yahweh Shai. And that's a fact. Yeah. First John 3 and 23. And this is and this is his commandment that we should believe on the name of the Son, Yahweh Shai, the Messiah, and love one another as he gave his commandment. Right, that's a command. You're supposed to love his son, Yahweh Shai. And that's the name you're supposed to call on if you want to be delivered. When you say a prayer, you should, you, you should start your prayer off by saying, in the name of, uh, you know, you pray to Yahweh in the name of Yahweh Shai. That's how you pray. I ain't trying to hear that, though. But y'all keep praying to sweet Jesus. See how you see how shit turns out for you. <laughs> Malachi 1 and 14. But cursed be the deceit, with half in his flock a male and vow, and sacrifice unto the Lord and corrupt them. For I am a great king, said the Lord of hosts, and my name is dreadful among the heathen. It's dreadful among the heathen. Oh, that's fine. Where was that at again? Malachi 1 and yeah. 14. Huh? Malachi 1 and 14. Yeah, so the Lord's name is dreadful among the heathen. Like we just speaking on them fake Jews in Israel, the ones who say they are Jews and are not, but it's synagogue of Satan. You see them walk around, they got their little hats on, they dress are all black, looking all demonic. That's why they're afraid to say the name of God, because they speak, they know Hebrew. They can read a Hebrew Bible, okay? So they know that the Lord's name is Yahweh, but they are afraid of that name. Because they know, because to them, the most high is a demon is going to destroy them. You know what I'm saying? They're terrified because they know that the Lord's going to kill them. He's going to exterminate their entire race. So they're afraid of that name. That's why they don't say Yahweh. They say Hashem, which in Hebrew, Ha means the, and Shem means name. So they just say the name. Ha, that's funny. It says the name of the Lord, Hashem. The Lord, the name of the Lord is dreadful to the heathen. That's why you can't get none of them fake Jews. They'll never say the name of the Lord ever. Even though the Bible commands us to proclaim the name. There's a lot of scriptures on that. Amongst men. Yeah, you're supposed to Uh, what's the scripture? I'm gonna find one on that. See if I can find one. To publish the name? Or something like that. Ah, oh, shit. What you got? You know you're going to the crown. Fire. Buddy, you the name. So, like, uh, uh, 7 is, uh, sorry, 13, it says, If I shut up heaven that there be no rain, if I command the locusts to devour the land, but if I send specialists among my people, I'm not going to start close. It's a second time to And Yahweh appeared to Solomon by night and said unto him, I have heard thy prayer, and I have chosen this place to myself for the house of sacrifice. If I shut up heaven, that there be no rain. But if I command the locusts to devour the land, if I send specialists among my people, if my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray, and seek my face, and turn from the wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven, and will sin, to hear their sins, and will hear their, their land. Uh, now my eyes shall be open, and my ears attentive to the prayer that is made in this place. Pretty much why that's why I said the Hebrews fears that name because if you pray to him, then you got no choice but to come back. You know what I'm saying? That's why he saw a group for so long because he managed to get the name. Okay. I got a quick one for the uh, precept. Saul, let me say something quick. Yeah, go ahead. This is why they trying to get us up off the streets because they ain't trying to hear this. Yeah, they trying to get tired of him. That's why they've been deleting the YouTube channel. Now they're going to try to delete us. Literally. Yep. Yeah. That's good, bro. Uh, I'm going to get it real quick. You got more than that, too, right? Uh, Psalms 118. They compassed me about. Yea, they compass me about, but in the name of the Lord or in the name of Yahweh, I will destroy them. Because <laughs> if the Lord gives that power, though, we're gonna be we're gonna be killing our enemies. That, that's a good one, right? I just I just did a search on name of the Lord. I was like, how many results I get? 115 results. Hey, the name is important. You know, you just 
can't open any door without with any key. You can't start any car with any key. You know, you got to have the right key. And you got to have the right key for salvation. <laughs> you know, you know, that's the message that we get. Oh, we got to get the, there's that favor. I got to hold it back. I got some of this. I'm overwhelmed. Let me get this one real quick. I got to calm down. This is Psalms 102 and 15. <laughs> so the heathen shall fear the name of the Lord and all the kings of the earth thy glory. Ooh, the heathen going to fear that name. And two thirds is heathens too. <laughs> they are heathen. Two thirds is heathen. Two thirds of our people are heathens too. So they gonna fear the name of the Lord when the time pops up, man. Hell, they fear it right now. You know what this truth? That's why they they make a common and drive by stuff. Cause yeah. they fear it. You know the truth. The name of the Lord. I got a perfect precept for that one. Look at this. Deuteronomy twenty eight ten. And all the people of the earth shall see that thou art called by the name of the Lord, or the name of Yahweh, and they shall be afraid of people. <laughs> all the heathens will be terrified of it. They used to be terrified of it, but actually they still are terrified of Jake. That's why you see all these white people, they terrified of uh, so-called black people. That's why they have that. That's why every corner, every city, every block is full of police officers. Yeah, that's why the police are, if you walk past uh, one of these rich white people, you're gonna hear the door go click, click, click. click. Click, click, click. Look at this house. Look at that house. Damn, get it. He said the name. He said the name. Yeah, I heard about it. It is silly. That's not for sure. He's in a child's state of home. It's funny as hell. Hey, that's really Jake, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Child's state of home. That's great. Jake is like a child. Can you imagine when we give him power, man? We're going to be like, we're going to be in that child's state. We're going to be playing, man. Oh, that's true. <laughs> we're going to be playing, man. You know? <laughs> but there's this scripture Paul talked about how he feels like a young man <laughs> in the spirit. He feels like he's young, but his body is weak and yeah, trash, you know? That's how I be feeling. I feel like I'm young, but I be like, damn, I got shit my birth, I'm, I'm getting old. I try to ignore that, you know? You gotta keep, you gotta keep that young spirit. Not like a, don't get it twisted. Scriptures say put away childish things. These young motherfuckers are stupid. Yeah. They don't know how to deal with the world, women, uh, money. They don't know how to do shit. They don't. These young motherfuckers. Fucking, fucking stupid. Oh, oh, that song went, you, the whole song's 118. The whole chapter is just done by the name of the Lord. You see that? Look, the whole chapter. Listen, this song's 118 and 26. Blessed is he that cometh in the name of Yahweh. Yeah, we have blessed you out of the house of Yahweh. Like, you know what scripture I'm saying. You get blessed, man. You get blessed with all kind of wisdom knowledge and understanding. All kind of doors and windows open for real. Just from that name, man. Just from the name. I'm about to have to get that famous scripture. Which is dreadful among the heathens. in the name of the Lord, man, in the woods with them niggas, man. A bunch of niggas in the woods. And he made a video on it and uploaded that shit. That's what's so funny, man. Most I ain't gonna forget about that, man. Hell no. He ain't gonna forget about that. They ain't gonna forget about none of that shit they do. No, no. I got a, I got a famous script, a couple of them. Well, this is at Philippians 2 and 9. Wherefore the Most High also hath highly exalted him, talking about Yahweh Shai, which also proves what? The Son is not the Father. The union the Most High exalted himself and didn't say that. <laughs> Wherefore the Most High Stupid. had oh yeah, dumb. The Most High hath highly exalted him and given him a name, which is above every name. 
that in the name of Yahweh Shai, every knee shall bow of things in heaven and things on earth and the things under the earth. <laughs> yeah, things under the earth. We ain't going too deep on that one. Right. I ain't even trying to explain that one. Is that the one that says? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And oh, let me go back to it. Now, bug, that's some bug. That's bugged out too. Visible and invisible. Invisible. God. Angels all around us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they serving Yahweh Shah. Let me just pull up my Bible. Ministering unto him in the kingdom of heaven. Praying. Can you mean he? Heaven Father created angels just to just to worship. That's that's bad, man. All day, all day. That's all they doing is singing and worshiping at his feet. That's power. That's real power. Oh, here we go. I'm thinking about it. I think that's cool. This motherfucker eating my fish in the heavens. I think that visible and invisible, that's Colossians, I think. Yeah, yeah. This devil fish in the Lord of the heavenly father. They up in the heavens playing around with naked little kids and shit. <laughs> yeah, you see all them paintings and stuff? All the angels is naked little children. That Renaissance art. That's the most, who, who gave that shit a pass? <laughs> you know what I mean? Beautiful. They, they, what in the prescription to say that all the angels flew around butt naked with little tiny penises? Watching each other's wrong. And they was babies. <laughs> That's pedophilia. You're right. Watching each other's wrong. And they got the picture of the, uh, the Sistine Chapel, Adam and the Most High, both butt ass naked, right. touching each other's fingers. What kind of madness is that? That's madness. Everybody saw that's such a beautiful work of art. I guess what? That's just getting fucking burnt with fire. Yeah. Ain't gonna be no more Vatican or uh, Sistine Chapel. All that work Michelangelo <laughs> got put, that shit getting destroyed. Came as fruitless labor. Yeah, that shit is trash. Baruch 2 and 1. I'm going to start at the top. Hey, plus, like, that's a great man with Jimmy word. Yeah. Go ahead. Therefore, the Lord hath made good his word, which he pronounced against us and against our judges that judged Israel and against our kings and yeah. our princes and against the men of Israel and Judah oh, to bring upon us great plagues such as never happened under the I ain't take a single sip. I ain't took a single sip. Being cold. I'm sorry, what did you read? Well, I thought you were. Yeah, but we out here to wake up Israel. That's who we out here for. The church. This is it. This is the church. We're Hebrew Israelites. The ones that... Are you guys in the same group or the other gentlemen that do the same? No, no, not everybody's not the group. It's going to do the same thing. Which one? The purple ones? Red. We was just talking about them. Yeah. It's hard for me to really ask questions. Because they don't like the answer. They exactly. Don't. They ain't got no answers. They got no answers. Answer Is it? Is it? They're not even authorized. <laughs> you know, we got the KJV authorized. They're not authorized. Yeah, yeah, they, they, man, they just out here to get your money, man, be honest with you. They look, come out here with all the nice garments, look at all smooth and slick. Them dudes are just, they teach them. We just actually just talked about them. Because they teach him for something the Bible calls filthy lucre's sake for that money. You know what I mean? I look at it as like the Pharisees instead of... Oh, okay. They like the Pharisees for they, sure. They just like the Pharisees. Right in the middle of the street, giving the big, big thing. But then when the knowledge thereof is being asked, when I asked, I said, what is the name of my, of my Savior? What is the name? What do I call him? Right. Yeah, that, we, that's the spirit. spirit. We was just talking about that's that because a of, that's the spirit of hate. If you gonna damn my soul, then where's your blood? Where's your hand? Because they don't even teach the, the true name of the Lord. They'll call the Lord. Uh, they say you gotta call him Christ. Christ. And so, there's no mercy in that either. No, nah, there's no mercy. You know, there's no mercy in ignoring brothers' questions. You actually, you were commanded to answer questions. You're commanded to, and that's the word. Check this out. Yeah. Check this out. Second Timothy two and twenty four. And the servant of the Lord must not strive. But be gentle to all men, apt to teach. Apt to teach. You gotta be apt to teach. Thank you. Yeah, you know what I mean. So that's why we out here. We we don't we don't turn our back to nobody, man. You unless, unless you've been an asshole. That's right. Because the scripture also says to avoid <laughs> foolish questions too. Yes. You know. So and, it, I, and I get that. And, right. And I, and I understand it because I'm in, like, and I don't come with this common knowledge. At least I don't try to because 
it says in the word to study yourself to you show you yourself approved. Oh, yeah. That's right. Uh, you I, see Bible the, college. I don't think that is. Because I want to know. If I'm asking the question, it's not because I'm trying to be funny or because of my opinion. No. 